And Christine, with the spread of COVID-19, there's concern that new strains may actually develop. But what does that exactly mean? CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez explains in tonight's Max Minute. There's been a lot of buzz and concern lately about whether the coronavirus has mutated into new forms or strains. The answer is yes, the coronavirus has mutated. That's what viruses do, all of them. The more important question is, are these mutations more dangerous to humans? Do they make corona more infectious or transmissible? Do they cause more serious disease? The small genetic changes seen so far in corona don't appear to do any of these bad things. In fact, mutations in viruses are just as likely to change them into more benign germs than more dangerous ones. Plus, the genetic changes seen so far in corona are relatively minor, partly because this virus actually has a way to proofread its own genome when it copies itself, keeping it pretty stable. The mutation rate in corona is only about half that of a flu virus. That's good news for a possible vaccine. A stable virus means a vaccine could induce longer lasting immunity. We might not have to make a new vaccine every year as we do with the flu virus. So mutations, yes. Worry, not now. And if you have any questions for Dr. Max, we invite you to post them on our Facebook page. You can find it at facebook.com slash CBS New York.